Hello, Brenton Powers here at Calvary Chapel Bible College, Europe, in Vita, Hungary. And this is the castle behind me where we have uh, more than one program. There's a three-year Calvary Chapel Bible College um, accredited bachelor degree program. There's AVFL or A Vision for Life, which is a six-week summer discipleship program. There is a missions training program for those uh, who want to be missionaries after a year of studying in that program. And there is a bunch of conferences going on here throughout the year. And uh, my wife and I are serving here as part of the team with a home fellowship. Hi, Lena. There she is. And it's a uh, Saturday, so we just had brunch and um, kids are riding around, playing with their friends. There is a bunch of other missionary kids here. It's great to be part of the team. And um, Lena, what do you like about being here? I didn't plan for this, but can you say hello? Hello. It's nice to be a part of a team here, whether missionaries to work with, sort of with. What do you do here? How do you help? Besides helping me all the time behind the scenes? Um, yeah, mostly minister to my family and serve them, love them, homeschool the kids, and uh, host a home fellowship once a week with the students, and just be available to listening ear for the students, need someone to talk to, yeah. pray for them. And... What'd you do last night? <laughs> I don't want to talk. Okay. <laughs> She's not the talker of the family. I'm more so. I'm teaching evangelism and discipleship every Monday for two hours and overseeing the audio visual ministry. That means I run the soundboard and teach other guys how to um, uh, make the sound of recordings sound better and um, we're recording a lot of classes all the classes in Hungarian there's Hungarian classes English classes bilingual classes uh, my classes with the translator Isabella translates so that's there on the internet and there's uh, 70 students in class and about 70 students outside of class who are taking the correspondence program listening online just Hungarian students who are listening online. Um, there's many more that listen and are taking the correspondence classes in English. Um, so it's great being here in Hungary. Um, at the moment we're not hungry. Uh, that's the favorite joke, isn't it? Are you hungry in Hungary? Um, but they're feeding us well here at the cafeteria. Uh, that's a bonus. Teachers get to eat at the cafeteria for free. But we also buy our own groceries and, and have meals at home, just to maintain that family time. Um, so with that said, if you wanted to support us, there's two ways of doing so. We need ministry support and we need to raise our personal family support. So if you want to give toward ministry, you want to give a non, uh, if, if you want to give a tax deductible donation, give to our account at Saving Grace World Missions. That's sgwm.com slash powers. You can click on become a financial partner. And so that's tax deductible for you. Um, but if you'd like to give non-tax deductible, it doesn't matter to you, you can give to our personal account at PayPal. Just go to paypal.com and say you want to give a gift to Brenton Powers at gmail.com. We'll receive that directly, and they only take 2.9% of your donation as a fee. Um, we are giving 10% of our donations to uh, Saving Grace World Missions the, that goes through them, and we pay income taxes there at Saving Grace, as well as for insurance and. Um, so, we receive approximately 75% if you give through Saving Grace. 
uh, but we received 97 point, what would that be? 97.1% of what you give through PayPal. So there's pros and cons to, to both. You can set up a monthly donation at Saving Grace World Missions, whereas at PayPal it's, if you want to give a one-time gift, it's very quick and easy and direct. So with that, just we thank you for your support. If you choose to give anyway, we really appreciate it and it helps us to stay here on the mission field and serve making disciples of the students who and equipping them who are going to go into the missions, some of them going back to their home churches, but we're equipping them with the Word of God so that they can take the gospel to the nations. And there's 15 different nations represented in the student body this semester. Uh, students from India, from Hungary, from Japan, I'm sorry, not Ch Japan, from Korea, and from China, and uh, Syria. And my big assignment for them is to have them preach the gospel in three to ten minutes on a video or audio and post it on YouTube to share with the world. So of my 140 students in class and online, there will be 140 people sharing the gospel online. That's And none of them have done this before. So we're making disciples and multiplying laborers. So I like what Moody said. I would rather put a thousand men to work than do the work of a thousand. So that's what our ministry is all about. That's what we're doing here. And that's our update for March 2013. Thank you very much for watching this long video and caring about our lives, being a part of it. So uh, God bless you.